Tommy Robbins, a villain to many, but a hero to some. We have laws in this country to prohibit hate speech. I've never been arrested for anything to do with racism, anything to do with hate speech. Many people have been silenced in this country for decades through the accusation of racism. Speech isn't free if it has consequence. And right now it has consequence. Political persecution. How can I be sent to prison for asking a paedophile how he feels about his sentence? That's all I ask. I do talk openly about Islam and I have a problem with the Islamic ideology because it has a problem with me as a non-Muslim, so I'll talk about it. That doesn't mean I have a problem with every single Muslim. Islam is an idea, Muslims are people. I should be free to criticise this idea as much as I want. Yeah. Islam's but, an idea, but, a bad idea. And, it, and Islam Muslims is a faith. No, it's an idea. It's faith. a faith. It's an idea that you can change your mind. No, it's a faith, like yeah. Christianity. Like Scientology. A hate crime carries a more severe sentence. So why are these men who are raping kids who are openly saying why they're doing it, yeah? they're making racial slurs every time to the victims. Yeah, I can see you're very passionate about it. Yeah, I do, about, and about... I, get I get passionate about it because I travel the country and I meet these kids, or, their women, or the women, and it is horrifying and devastating. My question to you is that you talk about Muslim extremism, as you should, but you don't mention... There's no groups of EDL or groups of the far right picking up young Muslim girls and raping them. It's not happening. Luton went from when I was born in 1982 to one mosque. We've now got over 40. What point? That's not bad. You know, it's, no, it's it, is, it is a bad thing because Mohammed beheaded 600 people in one day. Is he a good guy? Yeah. He married a six-year-old and he shagged her when she was nine. Is he a good guy? Black Lives Matter as an organisation is, is, has got nothing to do with black people. It's created to cause division and it happens every time there's an election in the United States, they come to prominence. I look at Gareth Southgate's football team and you're all getting on your knees and you're going to take our football club out and play in Qatar, are you? Where 6,000 people have died building those stadiums. There's still slavery now, yeah? And what are you going to do about it? Are you going to wear your rainbow armband in Qatar? No, you're not, right? You're not. Notorious right-wing group accused of being violent racists who have taken to the streets to fight what they view as homegrown Islamic extremists. I despise Nazis as much as I despise Islamists. Am I willing to be the public face for them? No, I'm not. People have to understand, I was leader of a street protest movement. Our job was to put pressure on the Muslim community and the government. Yeah. I, I thought we'd march in our thousands, we'd wake them up from within, they'd end up turning on the radicals. It had it caused like a revolution within their community. It, it, it didn't. At the end, he comes over, I'll stick fucking holes in you. Yeah? This scumbag. I tried to find him. And, it, and I, I said, I'm with my fucking kids. And he goes, fuck your kids. And my kids sitting there, they start crying. And uh, and from then, my son started having panic attacks. And the first thing I done when that happened is I, I said to the counsellor, dude, I said, I need to bring home. I need to get my son a counsellor. Oh, I don't know. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to do whatever the fuck I want. Yeah. And that's why I'm doing this. I'm going to do whatever the fuck I want. If I want to talk to, and if you don't like who I'm talking to, it's super simple. You just don't listen to that episode.